gonna fly into that, aren't we? They say that the rings of Maklu 4 perpetually rain fire down upon the godless abominations that dwell below. How fun. <laughs> I'm sure it's worse than it looks, too. It is. Many of my people braved this same treacherous pilgrimage before me, never to return. Quill parks, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> we were not fated to die this day. Unless, of course, Fin Fang Foom devours us whole. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whoa, 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 we gotta find him first. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> oh, this is insane. This is how we park, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! That definitely shouldn't be sparking! We can worry about that after we catch our dragon. And convince Lady Hellbender to help us bust the church a new one. Before setting out on our quest, let us rouse our spirits with a Katathian battle anthem. What? Like now? You know what? <laughs> Fuck it. Let's do it. Now listen closely. Ancient Katathian is a powerful tongue with words that hold great meaning. Follow as I lead the melody. So tra ju tu kluk, pel dagor morgath, sol tas flander gath. Really? We're doing this? So tra ju tu kluk, pel dagor morgath, sol tas flander gath. Tagar kon ot kol. Vol malki ultath, gath and kol galmak. Targath gone and kol, vol malki ultath, gath and kol galmak. Pel mafin sardut, jod kain agal tau, Gothan Kogalmak. Pelmafin Sarduth. Jotan Kogalmak. Galmak, Galmak, Soltath Flander I am Groot. Yeah, I liked it too. What does that last line say, Drax? Soltath Flandergath, 
It means we will be victorious. The Milano isn't gonna self-destruct or anything while we're gone, right? How many times do I gotta tell you? The ship probably ain't equipped with self-destruct systems. All good, buddy? I'm Groot. We're gonna pull this off. I know it. Of course. We have to. For Nikki. I knew this day would come. I was destined to battle the Dragon Lord of Kakaranthara. Bet you didn't think you'd be fighting him with this team of a-holes. I did not. I am thankful fate has granted me this honor. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Shivering tit wishes it's cold. <laughs> That's not really how that saying goes. You want to correct me, or you want to find Fing Fang Foom and save the galaxy? I want Fin Fang Foom. And the galaxy saving thing, I guess. Assuming Hellbender even goes for this. Lady Hellbender will go for it. Okay, well, I ain't seeing no foom foom. We should look for Katana. Oh, <laughs> the legends of raining fire are true. Any other legends we should know about? Legends of glorious death. Well, as long as it's glorious. Anybody else hearing a high-pitched whine? I just heard it. Not my voice. Watch out! The place is falling apart. Uh, we did not come here to be slain by ice and rocks. There is only one noble way to die on Mark IV, like so many of my people before us. Someone remind Trax we ain't come here to die! No one's dying! We're taking Foom alive. We're handing him over to Lady Hellbender alive. And we're getting her to help us take on the church's armada. So in this plan of ours, the armada part is where we die? <sighs> Maybe, but definitely not before that. Go team! Looks like a dead end. Glorious dead end. Gotta admit, I kinda love how excited you are about all this. All right, Drax, channel some of that excitement toward this rock. Ah, I shall pretend it is the head of Fin Fang Foom. Great, Drax just shattered the skull of the thing we're supposed to capture. Bye-bye, Galaxy. I am Groot. Groot says he wants to take it all in. Take your time, buddy. Might be your last chance to take anything in. Think Foom's in there? If fantasy books taught me anything, it's that dragons love to hang out inside mountains. I am Groot. Groot wants to know if those books said anything about catching dragons. I'm sure it had something to do with teamwork and trust. I can't remember the details because he didn't read the whole thing. I read a lot of different dragon books, okay? And there was always a mountain, and the good guys always win. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no one writing a book about us. I think I see something up ahead! Look! My people were here. Didn't we see these in Drax's memories when Mantis linked us all together? They are Katathian hunt markers. That's a lot of brave Katathians. After Thanos raised Katath, my people were left broken, physically and mentally. Their exodus led many of them here in great numbers. Uh, so how many of these hunters came back? None. They were all victims of Fing Fang Foo? Not victims. They came for the ultimate battle. Truly glorious death. Is it just me, or does it feel like we're a part of something here? Oh yeah, part of Foom's all-you-can-eat buffet. I mean, walking in the footsteps of Drax's people, out here to save the galaxy, makes you want to believe in destiny. I'm not trying to kill the moment or nothing, but everybody listed here was destined to be monster chow. If we all die, will die like proper Katathians. If we all die, everyone dies. Magus is gonna consume everything. Then let's catch Foom and make sure that doesn't happen. Couldn't Foom have picked a warmer planet to call home? Perhaps the end was what? Is that Okay, team. We can't make quick work of this thing, and we got no right going out of the Fin Fang Foom. Well said, Will. Uh, the fewer spores you breathe in, the better. Drag, destroy! I shall break their bones! Ha! We fight in the footsteps of so many of my people. I just wish they cleared out the beast! 
did you call it, Rocket? We're stopping! Let's flip them over to see if it picks the same! We really don't have time to mess around like this! We're moving as fast as we can! Slow down! You will defeat this beast! You will capture food! It is our destiny! And don't forget the part about getting rich in the end! We've got to apply more pressure! than the thing we just fought. Ten... Thousand. That's what I think. No one said this was gonna be easy, Rocket. Right, right, but 10,000 times, Quill, Drax is the literal one, remember? Obviously, our chances of pulling this off suck. A lot. Gamora, I'm thinking I can get a pretty good vantage point from the top of this thing. Okay, just be careful, Peter. <laughs> I can see the whole crater from up here. Maybe Boom's not in the mountain after all. Maybe he's down there somewhere. You tell us. I mean, if I were a dragon, I'd definitely want to stop around down there. The legends do tell of Fin Fang Boom stalking Maku's greatest caldera. Good enough for me. We can probably work our way around the edge and find a way down. <gasps> Flark and Hala! Whoa, got a load of them claw marks. You gotta be Fooms, right? He's even bigger than his legend. So, yeah, uh, when we find him, let's avoid the claws. We need to cross here, too. Just not sure how. I could clear the rubble from that ledge, Peter Quill. I just need something to throw. How about Quill? <laughs> Come on, it's not so bad. His fleshy frame would make a poor instrument of demolition. Okay. I'm thinking this is step one of a multi-step solution to get across this chasm. All right, and what are the next steps? Still working on that part. Crushing us all! I think I see what he's up to. Yeah! Crushing us all! Final step, Drax. If we can topple some of those rocks, we got to <laughs> Glorious! I swear, I've never seen you in such a good mood. Because you have never seen me on the Great Hunt before. What about our quarantine zone mission? Drax, I know you've been waiting for this a long time. Enjoy it, man. Thank you, Peter Quill. I must admit that with everything that has happened, I need this. Everyone get ready! There's something up ahead! Pretty sure it sees us, whatever it is. Right, more boom food to deal with. Do not underestimate anything that survives the perils of this planet. Good advice. Rocket! Move up! Should this be too cold for worms on this planet? They shelter inside the rocks, Peter Quill! 
and come out only to feast on the dead! I wonder if Big Ben Boom's gonna spit ice or fire at us! Maybe he'll be super cool and turn himself in for a good cause! Okay, let's just think things through a moment. Since when is that a thing we do? What if we're too late? What if Raker finishes what he started and the ritual... Then we're doing all of this for nothing. Not for nothing. If our final act is to challenge Fin Fang Fu, it will be an honorable final act. I don't do final acts. I'm a survivor. Just hope we are not too late. All right, let's figure out a way to get through. We're in a rush, apparently. There, see? More ominous peaks. This planet's starting to give me the creeps. I keep thinking Foom's gonna claw us from behind. Fin Fang Foom is a legendary beast. Legendary beasts do not claw from behind. Maybe not, but smart ones do. Thanos would have loved this planet. Mm -hmm. Time for a feat of strength, Drax. I need to get closer. Gorg! Way too <laughs> close! They say that Fin Fang Foom uses the planet's treacherous surface to test would-be adversaries. Careful! Deadly gas! So here's an idea. Why don't we lure Boom into one of these gas caves? Knock him out! Power. I want full credit for this. the last time, Drax! We're not killing Fin Fang Foom! We're catching him to give the Lady Hellbender so she forgives us and hopefully helps us fight the church. Stare down a legendary dragon with the fate of the entire galaxy at stake. I ain't gonna hold this up. Wow. I'm impressed. You really conquered your fear. Yeah, well, it ain't about me no more. Instead of giving her full any chance, Lady Eight might settle for a few. This is definitely in Drax's wheelhouse.
face. Yeah, way to ruin it. Let's just get back to catching boom and saving the galaxy. Oh, this place is crumbling all around us. Whoa! Barking, Maclu! Maclu 4, Peter Quill. We must be fair to the other Maclu. Legendary teeth and claws of Finfang Fool. You know, I'm gonna be really disappointed if he doesn't live up to all the hype. <laughs> Assuming we live that long. Peter, look! There's smoke ahead. Think it's Foom? More likely it's people. Great. Maybe they'll know where he is. Or they'll attack us on sight. I could probably infiltrate the camp, look for weak links, make an example of the right person, bleed them out in front of their crew. The shock of it will cause confusion, or maybe even surrender, and we carve through the rest. Hey, uh... Is everything okay? We didn't really talk after your, um... The killing my sister thing? Yeah, and other tangential topics. I'm fine. Ish. Okay. <sighs> Peter, there's a good chance Nikki's already lost. No. I don't accept that. And if she is, I know I'll be the one expected to make the hard call. She's my daughter. But I'm the killer. We both know that. It's not gonna come to that. And if it does? If it's a choice between her and literally everything else, Peter, you'd do anything for someone you care about. And we both know that I... We both know that you would as well. Which is why you're exactly who I need to bring my girl home. Alive. I hope you're right. Hell, Muffin, Sargut. Foom! It's Foom! Yes! Keep going, keep going! Just you fucking rock! Yes! Yeah, Ominous is right! Groot says to put on your sliding pants. Looks like the only way down. Here goes! I don't like this! Ah! Accelerating! Ah! Oh, this! Kind of amazing! Also really terrifying. Fang Foom, you seen him? Big wings, nasty teeth. Purple shorts. What do you mean, purple shorts? What, I heard he wears purple shorts. Ancient legends do tell of such a thing. See? This one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Melt that one, too. That one. How did you know your guns would work back there? They've saved us three times already. I mean, how? 
how did you know they'd melt that ice wall? Oh, uh, I... So we could have just as easily died horribly. Yep. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. Ugh. Well, what is that? Come on, Rocket. We got past your fear of water. I can't jump. It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You don't really strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magical. I swear, Will, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh yeah, the zipper. How do we get across this gunk? Perhaps we can leap to the ledge above. I wouldn't hold your breath. Oh, of course not. Steady breathing is essential to an effective leap. Good thing that rock tried to murder us or we'd have never got Quill's sweet new power. Maybe we should almost kill you more often. That's not how it works. It's when people I care about are in danger, and then I get this... If we can find something to stand on, maybe we can walk across. Or better facilitate our leap. Or that. At least it ain't quite as cold in this cave. You're the one with fur. Groot's practically naked. Fruit don't get cold, but it's a big baby in the heat. I'm Groot. Hey, we're all flammable. I'm Groot. Hey, how about we make something to stand on? We could bring part of the ceiling down. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltinator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? Petey Hotguns. No! Captain Fireball. It's not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glob. Captain Heat Glob. Nope, no. Time, Groot. Groot. Here's good. Trying to communicate. Please don't. Star Lord! See? <laughs> Star Lord! Is it just me or did he sound a little irritated? Nope, there was definitely hatred in that voice. <laughs> Always the charmer, Quill. Check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on top. Ah! It burns! Groot says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. Burn, baby, burn! 
nice. I ain't ever gonna get tired of that. I imagined Fung would sense our arrival and rush to face us. I am disappointed. Maybe he's hiding from us. Unlikely. We did kick the crap out of that ugly dweller thing. And spank both blood brothers. Yeah. You know, we're developing quite the reputation. Maybe Foom's hurt. Look, Will, it's your new best bud. I'd say communication has failed. Another up there. I'm done playing with the snow monkeys. Wendigo. Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling Wendigo. Wendigo. See? See? Sounds like we haven't seen the last of them. <laughs> they say Fin Fang Foom is a foe unlike any one could imagine. I mean, he's basically a dragon from the fairy tales on Earth. Maybe Hellbender will want to add some of those Wendigo to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge. Their zoo? Looks more like a dinner plate! Let's make sure we don't end up on the menu. This reminds me! 
reminds me of our monster hunt in the prohibited area. Let's hope it doesn't end the same as that one. Eat last night, you freak out! Yeah. Think that wreck is the camp we saw? Nah, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side of it. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there.
I never truly believed this day would come. All right, Groot, give me a boost. About yay high. Yay is not a measurement. Groot knows what he means. We'd better not get stranded out here. All right, heads up. I'm gonna drop something down for you guys. That's the nice plan. Look out below! Ha! Battle war! You think those creatures were using this ship for shelter? Screw them! They're dead. Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke. Any more hostiles. Maybe it's just a nice glowing fire and some cigar and spirit. Ooh, maybe it's a barbecue. What's barbecue? What? You guys have never had barbecue? Charbroiled burgers, grilled steaks, baby back ribs? Why would you consume the ribs of an infant? Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Is all this foom? Undoubtedly. 